Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast from meteorologist Jeremy Wheeler. All right, well, our temperatures today and tomorrow are going to be in the low 50s. We'll be a little bit cooler. We made it to the low 60s yesterday in Hampton Roads, uh, but, well, today we're dropping temps back about 10 degrees. It's still not too cold, but still the average high is 58. Wish it was a little warmer. Now, it is going to be a little warmer. Sunday, 54, just a little bit, but Monday, 58. And then 64 on Tuesday. Of course, after the weekend we warm up, but uh, I got a feeling we're going to hit the 60s on Tuesday. Pretty solid as we have uh, kind of a developing weather system that'll be just off to our west. So anyway, today we've got a cold front. Let's call it a cool front that has moved through the region, and our winds are just now beginning to turn out of the northwest. And today they'll pick up out of the northwest. That'll keep our temps a little bit cooler again compared to yesterday. Now here's Super Doppler 10. No rain in the region. We got a little bit of cloud cover, but there's no rain. And these clouds that are around right now, the spotty clouds, they're going to break up and we're going to have a lot of sunshine today. So future track, mostly sunny skies for this morning, through the midday, through the afternoon. Beautiful looking weather. Again, a little cool, a little breezy, but lots of sunshine. So there's one big plus out there. Going to 6 o'clock, we got a lot of sunshine there as well. And we got some quiet weather for the overnight. We'll have mostly clear skies. So dry weather between now through tonight and tomorrow morning. Now, we've got uh, some chill in the air tomorrow morning. Temps in the low 30s, and then the clouds move in. By noon, we could see a spotty shower ahead of the pack, but most of the rain showers come in after noon, after midday. So here we are, 3 p.m., scattered showers up through about 5 o'clock. Notice the rain moves out for a while Saturday evening, but then it comes back after midnight for a bit. But the good news is it moves out mostly by 7 a.m. or Sunday, rather. So that's going to impact the uh, Shamrock Marathon. I think there might be a stray shower out there right before the race, and then hopefully it's out of here by 7 a.m. and uh, 7.30. Now, at the moment, we've got dry conditions in 31 in Chesapeake. We're at 40 in Hampton, upper 30 Suffolk, 34 in Williamsburg. I've got 38 degrees in Newport News, 41 in Norfolk, 38 in Portsmouth, 35 in Virginia Beach. Temperatures a little bit mixed, but this afternoon we'll all aim for the low to mid 50s. We got 50 in Killable Hills, 54 Currituck, Elizabeth City, and 53 in Chesapeake. Low 50s in Virginia Beach, Norfolk, Portsmouth, 52 in Suffolk. Lots of sunshine. You got that northwest breeze, 10 to 15 miles an hour, gust to 25. So it is going to be breezy, kind of like yesterday, but today the wind is out of the northwest. West, and so that was what gonna, is going to make the difference. Highs near 50 in Melfa, 51 in Hampton, 52 Newport News, low 50s Gloucester, Pocosin, Yorktown, and then 55 in Williamsburg. Surrey about 53 degrees today. Now at Ocean View on Saturday we'll have the parade. We'll have increasing clouds. There might be a stray shower by the end of the parade. Maybe a stray shower, but only one or two, and that's it. And, but after the parade, I think that some of the rain is going to come in. Temperatures in the 40s and definitely some cloud cover. On Sunday for the Shamrock Marathon, temperatures starting off cold. We're going to be in the upper 30s. There's always a little bit of a breeze down there at the ocean front. It will be chilly. we got a sun cloud mix. Temperatures will be in the 40s by the end of the race. And there you go for the weekend. Again, some scattered showers Saturday afternoon. Maybe a stray shower early Sunday morning. Otherwise, Sunday's looking good. Monday's looking good. Highs in the 50s. But some rain moves out on Tuesday with that high of 64. And then behind that system, it's going to get colder. Highs only in the upper 40s Wednesday and Thursday.